Hello, this is the Slow Food Survivalist. In the following video, I'm going to show you how to build a very efficient uh, food dehydrator for less than 30 euros. First, the short list of required materials. An obsolete drawer cabinet, some polypropylene mesh, a heater and a thermometer. Then the tools. A screwdriver, measuring tape, stapler, pair of scissors, marker pen, drill, hacksaw, threaded rod, wing nuts and washers. The workflow begins with the removal of the bottoms of the drawers. Then it's time to measure the frame of the drawer and to cut somewhat oversized piece of polypropylene mesh for each of the drawers. To staple the mesh onto the drawers, a real carpenter's stapler gun would probably be the perfect tool. But as you can see, a regular office stapler works equally well. Next, it is time to remove the front footing of the cabinet for the air inlet. And to find and mark the place for the supporting rod, so that the rod will not interfere with the gliding drawers. Then just drill the hole to the each of the side panels. And push the threaded rod through the holes. Then attach a wing nut to the other end of the rod. And now it is easy to measure the correct length of the rod. Cut it and attach another wing nut to the other end of the rod and tighten it so that drawers glide smoothly in and out. Remaining work is to plug in the heater. The airflow can be controlled by sliding the top drawer slightly open. And the final touch is to place a sensor of a thermometer into the dryer. And here we are, a perfectly working uh, food dehydrator for less than 30 euros. Happy trying experiments and thank you for watching. 